the subscapularis is the largest and strongest portion of the rotator cuff. It's also the only one located in the front or anteriorly. It's surrounded by large, powerful muscles like the pectoralis major. We take away the superficial platysma here to allow better visualization. Next, the strong triangular muscle surrounding the shoulder called a deltoid. Now the trapezius is removed, which allows us excellent visualization of the entire rotator cuff. We see the posterior and superior portions of the rotator cuff. And after removing the biceps and the coracobrachialis, we can just start to see the subscapularis highlighted in yellow here. Utilizing the transparent mode, we get a much better view of the subscapularis as it sits on the front of the scapula or shoulder blade and inserts on the front of the humerus acting as an internal rotator and shoulder stabilizer. You can learn more at theshouldercenter.com.